It's a little warm out. I put pants on too. It's all right. I'm okay with pants. I, I live in pants. When I was a kid, all I did was skateboard, lived in pants because you can't wear shorts skateboarding. Yeah, I lived in pants skateboarding because when you would fall, like if you had shorts on, all bets were off. So that's why I always wore pants. So I'm okay in pants, but just I thought it was a little bit cooler today. But uh, the cool down is coming. I think today was the hottest day. Now we're going down to the 80s, upper 70s. I'm so excited for it. You excited for it? Look at those shoes. Dang, girl. You are styling. My goodness. I got my Dodger shoes on today. Just Dodger cap. Just feeling that Dodger, Dodger vibe right now. I think the other chair in the car. Only reason I say that is because we are headed down to Cleveland, down by Chattanooga. Uh, girls have a soccer tournament this weekend. Kind of weird. Uh, there's one game today, Thursday, and then two games Saturday. Nothing tomorrow. Um, and it's kind of weird with school and everything. Like, could they have a game on a Thursday this late? Uh, so, we are headed down there. It's a little, about an hour drive. Hour and five minutes or so. So, I'm going to head down with the girls early. And Babs will meet us down there. Uh, Mackenzie's feeling much better today, so that's good. Um, but we're going to head down there. Saturday, we're not going to be able to make the games because we have a wedding. So they will be down there and uh, doing their own thing. But I wanted to catch at least one of these games. We're going to head down there. And I was looking at my shoes. Like, my shoes are so nasty from this clay. Babs yells at me. She says, oh, you just need to wear one pair outside. Like, like that's ever going to happen. Like, wear one pair outside. Like, you can't avoid the clay. Like, the clay is everywhere. And you're going to get it on your shoes no matter what. I don't have one nice, decent pair of clean shoes. No, one person who can't wait for cold weather, huh? Can you not wait for cold weather? Are you just excited for it to cool off? Deck the halls? No. No, I'm not talking that. I'm talking just cooler than this. Ho, ho, ho yourself. That can wait. We got other stuff to worry about. Speaking of which, I, are they really canceling trick-or-treating for kids? Like, not just... Uh, all right, got to find a leash and harness for Macy. She's got her new collar on. She is loving it. Uh, she's getting her step count in. We're just keeping track of those steps. If we could only keep up with her step count, my goodness. All right, girls are home. We are going to head down there. Just got to grab Macy girl. Macy girl is going with us to all these things because it's too hard to leave her locked up in her crate. And then by the time we get home, it's 8 o'clock. And then she gets let out. And then she wants to play. And then it's time to go to bed. It doesn't work. So it's easier to take her with us, wear her down. Let her play do her thing and it gets used to the car and just hanging out on the leash and everything. So she's going to head out and uh, she's our she's our good luck charm anyways. All right, off to clean. There's some nice soccer fields. Really nice complex. All right, so we are in Cleveland at, I forget the name of this park, Moose Creek Park. Part of the Greater Cleveland Soccer Association. Gorgeous fields. Um, we're going to the, the girls are playing in this stadium over here, um, which is just natural grass, which is nice. Babs is down here. She just took off. She went to go get us a couple drinks just because it is a little toasty. She got Macy with her. All right, so looks like, looks like they'll have a fun game today. Too bad we're not going to be here Saturday for the other ones because those look like fun games too, but uh, this is really nice. This is. It's a cool stadium. It's a good stadium. I guess we could go try to hide in the shade over there, but there is no getting away from the sun. Never really been an umbrella person, but it is warm, and I went to go get an umbrella out of the car. I'm gonna pop an umbrella right now. That's nice. At least it's the team colors, that works. So I talked to some friends in California, and I guess those fires are just getting ridiculous. Like, there's just ash and smoke everywhere. No matter where you go, you can't get away from it. Um, but I saw an interesting thing from the CDC that suggested not wearing masks because the ash particles would not be picked up from the mask. The mask would not do anything for it, which is interesting because the coronavirus uh, particles are 10 to 15 times smaller than the average virus particle. So if it's not gonna pick up ash from a wildfire, I don't know. 
that's just something I saw. Maybe, maybe there's no truth to it. I don't know. It's from the CDC, though. I'm actually taking the, the night off filming. I'm not going to film this game. Um, just want to kind of enjoy, it, you know. I don't, I don't do that very often. I mean, I guess I enjoy it while I film, but I just kind of wanted to take this one all in, you know. See how this one goes. Never seen any of these teams. Don't know how they are. So, uh, so here they go. Good luck, girl. All right, what what a what a game. Uh, Tay got another goal. Fantastic. Kenzie shutting down the back again. I assisted, assisted. Coach looked like he was a little mad at halftime. Uh, just a little. I noticed he had a mask on and he was yelling, and then the mask came off, and the yelling continued. <laughs> A little upset, but a good finish. Good finish in the second half. Final score 4 1. So it's good. It's good for a tournament. And I mean, I don't know what the rest of the competition looks like, but I think if it's anything like that team, then they'll do okay. So <laughs> now we gotta drive home.